Pierce crosses the docks, where old acquaintances and new faces met their ends. All over the place, Leviathan slaves were wandering in search of a victim. After fighting his way through, and after discovering the truth about the origins of the cult and its founders, Pierce finally reaches the whaling station. He hopes to catch Sarah Hawkins before she does something bad. <laughs> That is that was an amazing voice. Do you like it? That was an incredible bit of voiceover. Do you think that was good? I've gotta say, you need some Radnor. This is like a bold claim. I kind of think after doing all of this reading, I, I'm slowly getting better at reading out loud and maybe yeah. even a little bit better at voices. I mean, that's how it works. You know, it takes uh, ten thousand hours to get good at something. Get good, son. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> So what's Sarah Hawkins gonna? What? Hey, what could she do anyway? Make a painting? Shit. Well, she's already done that, and that's clearly been quite fucking bad for everyone. Oh involved. yeah, it was, wasn't it? It killed like like a dozen people or something. Um, and she's the one. She's like the the oracle, the, the conduit to uh. Both the oracle and the conduit. Are you all right there? Are you. <laughs> I just wanted the seat to be up. Ooh, this to be down a fraction. There we go. Ooh. I should fucking hate that. 69. Nice. Okay, so we're back silent. He did a weird thing with his face there. I think that's just the sort of ropey animations. No, no. He's like thinking. It was a pensive look. Ooh. Hither thou shall be free. Sarah is with those bastards. I gotta find her quick. Okay. Is um, this a stealth section? I or? sure hope so, because... This... Stealth section. Is that, is that where I came in? I think it might... Oh. Or is, is that a door? No. Uh... I don't think so. Maybe well. It looks doorish. Yeah. But it looks like it's been um, boarded up. Right. Oh, hello. Oh. <sighs> this tank seems strong enough to break down the door. Oh, I didn't even see the tank. I was looking at the, uh, the eyelet. I didn't even it's see an eyelet. See the door. Yeah. This tank seems strong enough to break okay, down Okay, so we need to find some chain, break down the door. How's that sound? So I guess it's not a stealth section. I need to make a, a huge crashing noise as I <laughs> smash this thing open. Okay, right. Okay. So we do have a, a maxed out spot hidden, a rope remember? And a, hook. a rope and a hook. Could use that to hold the reservoir back. This looks like it's a job for... Oh, how do I do the Come on. B? Is that a B? It's time for the Riddle Bros. I think, I think bros. that's right. Okay, right. So, sweet. Rope You're and not hook. good at making letters with the hands. <laughs> that's, um, that's one riddle that's a bit too hard. <gasps> Ratty. He might know secrets. The cheese. <gasps> Alcohol. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, we can finally get that Rack's drink. best friend. Oh, yeah. you haven't had a drink in a while, have you? Uh, but we did manage to kill the... Um, Sarah Hawkins was probably taken behind the this huge door. Got to find a way to get through. She was probably taken behind <clears throat> the huge door. <clears throat> Maritime bank. <clears throat> Sperm whale. Okay. Sperm. So I guess this was, like, oh, keeping whale. track for, like, trading. Oh. Oh. You could just... Drink What is that? They're like... They're singing the spooky song, aren't they? Ghostly singing. <clears throat> oh, oh, God. I'm actually, I was surprised we could actually go in that room. Yeah, I really thought that was going to be locked. Okay, right. Where's the fucking hidden <sighs> shit? Oh, okay. Another volume of <gasps> the Reverend's Wife's Diary. Oh, I think we've got it all. These are the last entries of the pastor's wife. Her husband <clears throat> ordered his faithful to come together for a final ceremony in honour of the Leviathan. Uh, she fears that the pastor will ask them to sacrifice themselves to this abomination. She tried to escape. 
This is probably why her body was found in a cave under the mansion. Oh yeah, remember, she was, like, crushed. Um... Okay, right, where's, like, the hot li Looks no! like a page from the log. <clears throat> page from the log. Friday, 4th of June, 1847. 53 North, 53 West. Oh, so this is about the, the big catch. We're starving. The fish seems to have deserted the waters. If I don't quickly find an answer to this crisis, Fitzroy could well set off a mutiny. <gasps> Each day, more and more men believe in his tales of a miraculous catch. <laughs> Merciful God, help me. Wednesday, 9th of June, 1847. 57 North, 50, 51 West. Uh, we sighted an enormous whale further to the south. The biggest we've ever seen. Fitzroy keeps telling the men that this is the miraculous catch he promised them. We will catch it and bring it back home to feed our families. Wow. And this, this, was, this doomed them. They set everything in motion. Yeah, although I kind of think that he sort of already knew about that. Um, I think... So the Fitz, Fitzroy the Elder... I can't... I elder. gotta say, I still think they're the same dude. Uh, well, he's dead now, isn't he? Isn't he dead? Did he die? He's probably dead. Um, right, what this does he do? Seems strong enough to break down the door. Oh, I should have gone up the other ladder. Oh, I saw like a there was like a little fucking loop, and we've got a hook and a rope. I yeah. thought we were gonna like Indiana Jones our way across. Well, it's more like Tarzan, I guess, or something. I guess, I guess Tarzan might be more appropriate. But when's Indiana Jones set? He's like, uh, I mean, he's like, like 20s, twenty 30s. years from now. Uh, well, maybe oh. not quite that. Not fifteen. So. Locked. Locked. Let's hope the key isn't far. Oh, oh that's geez. like a little... The key is somewhere here for you to find. Okay. Right, well... And it's not far away. Oh. <clears throat> okay, well, I guess... I wish our spot-hidden powers were coming in useful now. Um... Hello? Sarah Hawkins was probably taken okay, behind you're this no good. Door. Okay, cut to find finding nice. key time lapse. <laughs> ah! Da -da -da -da. Okay, man, that was a quick, um, a quick finding key montage, I guess. Like, what's the worst that's gonna happen? Other than us mm. going clearly insane. Yeah. Probably exploding in some kind of tentacle slash fish based monstrosity. And sort of damning the world to the same fate as well. Oh no. Oh. I'm lucky if it's still sharp enough. Sharp enough for what? What are you gonna do with it, buddy? Oh. Oh. Oh shit, actually. Do we have any um fuck, what's the button? Oh, we've got no more experience to spend. But, investigation, isn't it? Yeah. So that's maxed, so... We should be fine. Oh, look. Oh. Cronk. This oh. handle moves the reservoir. Oh. If I can get some momentum, it might work as a ram. Oh, do I have to go and... Oh, tie it up and hook it up, then come back here. That sounds like a whole lot of ladder Doesn't climbing. Work. Oh, does it work? Uh, it mentions the Leviathan. How it drove the sailors mad. Oh. Okay. The whole crew has descended into madness. They speak of dreams, visions of a nightmarish city and a sleeping god. Madness. I locked myself in my cabin. I won't be able to hold out for much longer. <laughs> Fitzroy has 12 men at his side. Uh-oh. They sacrificed everyone who tried to stop them to their new god. I beseech you, almighty god, to have pity on our souls. This will be my last prayer. I can hear them whispering. I like the idea that he's not scared, he's just sort of like pissed off, and he's just like in his Doesn't cabin, work. just like, I can't believe, I can't believe him. I can't believe you done this. I was such a good captain. I was the best captain those men ever had. And now they worship We caught the bloody catch, didn't we? Fish monster. 
Like, why is there a mutiny if they have like the the catch? This should stop the cart. Because it sounds like they wanted to do a bit of sacrificing. I need something to cut the rope to release the tank again. You've got a knife. Oh, jeez, this all looks a bit a bit dangerous. Okay, go and cut the fucking thing. Surely, even just my lighter, I'd be able to burn the rope. Nope, it's fireproof. God damn it. I think you have to look at the thing, maybe? Yeah, I'm or... trying to burn it. No, it's not going to work, is it? Oh! Oh, fuck! Um... Are they cool? I don't like that the, we got the, the achievement beast in the cave. I mean, that's a little... Uh, <laughs> a little um, worrying. ominous. Oh, oh, no, no, don't worry. No, no, don't, no. Yeah, we found we yeah. found the the thing. Did you break the ladder? Did the ladder break? What the fuck? <laughs> Jesus! <Right. coughs> I did not notice the ladder breaking. F in the chat for uh, the ladder. Oh, the poor ladder. He served us well. You know, we went up him, we went down him as well. Yeah, a bit of a little bit of everything. Um, okay, do we still have the knife, or did we abandon the knife? I'm not sure what good the knife will do. Uh... So what's the weird green shit? Uh-oh. What the fuck? Okay. You saw something bad. Okay, I've kind of got a theory about, um, you know, like, our heart was beating. Yeah. So... At the beginning, you know we missed out on um, a oh, a bit of madness. There's like a, one of the um, sanity things that we don't have. Yeah. Uh, there was a part where like if we were in the dark too long, our heart started beating. Yeah. And I think that we basically avoided what is the avoided getting that darkness thing. So I think we should look at this and go a bit more crazy. God, maybe not look at it. What's that? Is that like the Ark of the Covenant? Hey! Ah! Oh! A fucking fish monster spat at me. And that was supposed to happen. Oh. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's okay. Hello. It's me, Detective oh. Pierce. Who is this? The quest for truth requires sacrifice. There's no room for compassion. Who's there? Your stubbornness of wanting to help others who would have deserted you is a weakness. Faith leads us inevitably to solitude. And in one's final moments, one is always alone. It's us. We're calling ourselves. You can't escape it forever. God. It will always find its way. Damn it. Yeah, fuck this noise. I... Oh, I don't think I'm allowed to do it. <clears throat> no. Where's, where's my gun? There's no gun. What if the bottle? Like, I could fucking smash a cultist in the head with a bottle. Just, you're being very rude. Answer the door. <laughs> it could be a client. Oh. Ooh. Is that actually your desk? Oh no, it isn't. Oh, that would have been really fucking oh, creepy. That would have been insane. good. Fitzroy and the mutineers took over the ship, and probably killed the captain. Uh, thirty-five north, uh, fifty-nine west. Fitzroy encouraged the men all day. They're in shock and can't overcome their trauma. They say they can hear the screams of their comrades turned mad. Some of them hurt themselves in a desperate attempt to stop the visions that haunted them. Others chose to embrace it. Fitzroy is one of the latter. He named the beast Leviathan because he believes in his biblical nature. I told him to rid of, to get rid of it before it's too late. That thing is not the work of God. No. Oh, is that Leviathan? Oh, look, it says at the top, Leviathan. Oh. Wow. It doesn't look like a whale. It looks like some kind of giant fucking, like, so, prawn So, what does it monster. say about two... 
two to three times bigger than common a whale. Common whale. The harpoon Hamilton stuck in the beast's brain probably oh. explains why it can't have. It can't it, leave. It seems paralyzed. It is still conscious. But it can't activate its defense systems. Or even move. Oh god, okay. What the fuck? Oh, oh nice. Uh, mm. the madness stones. Oh, sweet. Everything points back to the day they brought in that thing. Oh god, the doctor. Fitzroy. The, um, um, guy. The main Hawkins. boy. Hawkins. And... Jeff. Jeff Hawkins. Just oh no, Jeff. Just Jeff. Just some guy. Oh. Nice. Free oil. It's free oil. Oh. Okay. Oh god, so they cut bits off of it. Yeah, and they eat it. And that slowly sends people mad. But it's like a never-ending source of food. Oh! Because it just regenerates it. Oh. Or is it it's young? It looks like more like it's young or something. Oh god. Are they little babies from eggs? They eat his flesh while he's still alive. I guess it is just his flesh. And they're just lopping bits. So do you off. think this do you think Leviathan is a bit pissed off by them just eating, you know, his still living flesh? Maybe. Great below you. That's great. There's also a thing I could crawl through. I just wanted to um see if there was anything else over here. Like you want to pick up like a fucking weapon. You, man, like there are some really fucking good cleavers on this table. It's all right. You got a blunt knife. I've got a know? blunt little flick knife. Um so right, Pierce. I've got some points as well. Sanity. Okay, right. We're real fucking So we, I think we're not afraid of the dark. Oh, that's good. Because a lot of the game was in the dark. That would have been... Do we want to just like, look at this until we go mad? Yeah, just see what happens. Uh... Um... Oh, here we go. happens. Oh. Okay. Right, so it wasn't too bad no. grand scheme of things. Oh god. Okay. So you just go down. <laughs> oh, you don't like little spaces. What if I get my like bigger light out? Why did we take the pipe when we could have like crawled through that thing? Maybe we've got like a bit, uh. bit bigger. We must have eaten some of the meat at some point. Probably. Like if we were fed oh. some of the stew in the um in the hospital. Well, surely, like, the gas is fucking coming from all fish guts there. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. What? We've been really good. Oh, no. God damn it. You're going to do stealth properly this time. <laughs> Make sure you crouch. Stop running everywhere. That's not how you play stealth games. Ah, finally awake. Yeah. How do you feel, Mr. Pierce? Confused. Uh, Fuller! Son of a Was this bitch. all a dream? I'll Are we still you. in the asylum? No. No, I'm not even really with you. Well, to be perfectly uh. precise, I am with you. But not in this cell. What have you done to me? Me? Nothing really. <laughs> See, 
It's one of the exquisite effects of this incredible creature. Uh, Leviathan! I see you already know about it. Well, shall we begin? So, are we all connected on some sort of spiritual level or psychic level? Oh, my bed. <coughs> It take looks like the, absinthe. Take the treatment, don't take the treatment. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh my god. Oh, I guess we wouldn't get guessed anyway. Oh. Hey. Hey guys. What's up? Oh, they're just... They're not even cooking it. They're not even cooking it. It's like sushi. It does look a bit like bread. It does look oh, bready. Oh, mate, no. Meaty. Very meaty It's bread. like those mushrooms. Those giant mushrooms that grow. Oh, like portobello the... mushrooms. No, no. They're... Oh. Eat the meat. Don't eat the meat. I mean, this isn't real anyway. Well. Well, it's fine then. Oh, Christ. Uh, it's, it, like the way he bit into it, it looked like a big like gummy worm. From you, flesh, blood, spinal fluids. Don't fear. I created the mythological eye core from Leviathan's flesh. Who knows what I can make with you? I need your body for my research. Uh, Time to fuck off. Can I just fucking stab him? Like bam, that in his fucking neck right now. Boom. Use syringe on neck. It's oh. Like it's, oh. Well, that's convenient. Okay, use gun. Use. Whoa. Tom, Jesus. I didn't even hesitate. Unnecessary sacrifice. Oh. That was like his spirit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. Um. Oh. <laughs> Find the truth and be free. Be free. Are we just like serving Leviathan now? Yeah. Oh, shit. Well, nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. Um, okay. This is getting a bit fucking weird. This doesn't look like where we were. Oh. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, maybe don't take that uh, plank. It's not safe. Okay, none of them are safe. Maybe. I mean, there was another one. Oh, but Valve. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, uh. Uh, <clears throat> guys, I just wanted to get through. Ah, oh, sweet. Oh, no. Riddle Bros. <laughs> that was bad, I guess. Oh, so what? We have to remember which is the good pipe. Maybe. Oh, God. This one? I don't really understand. I guess that's the right one. You chose wisely. Okay. That's the reference. Nice. To... Oh. So I used the gas. And then... Does this work now? That heats the Not gas? Happening. Oh. Oh, do I have to follow this pipe as well? Because there's two pipes that are coming out. Yeah. <clears throat> um, Will it let you cross now? How are you supposed to know which way is the right way? Is there something we're missing? Is there a clue? Is there... If you use a light or something... Does it oh, show the are they, is it the ones that already exist? And aren't just appearing? Nope. <laughs> Okay, right from here. So we have to go oh. quite far back and then like a oh. like a loop. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I didn't want to say anything. <clears throat> it was better just watching it uh, play out. It's that one, isn't it? Oh, yeah, Riddle Bros. Um. Oh God. Ha How do we know which one it is? Are sure. you just randomly doing it? How how are you supposed to know on this? Okay, right then, right. You Riddle must be Bros. looking at the pipes. Oh, okay. Is there like only one over there? Okay, it's like the yeah. closest one to us. Riddle Bros. Okay. Oh, is this like a new way back? Nice. Why couldn't we have just taken this one the first time? Because it wasn't there. It's not working. Oh! Uh. Oh, are we gonna like kill the Leviathan? Or. Put it out of his misery. Or it. release it. <clears throat> or do something. Uh. Oh! Shit, okay. Holy shit. Right, so I do have to do stuff. Yeah. I'm gonna guesstimate. We're gonna die seven times. Seven times, okay, we've had one already. <clears throat> I feel like there's gonna be like little dead ends or stuff like that. Uh, that was Whoa. very explodey. Nope. God, stay away from the jars. Um. Wow, this place is really fucking going up, huh? This is... And it's all your work. You didn't realise, but that's what you were doing. Wait, but I've got a gun again. <clears throat> oh, Fitzroy is fine. Time to hoist the white flag. We're not gonna hurt you. Oh, use the battering ram again. I won't go without a fight. You think you're here of your own accord? Stay back, or I'll put a bullet in your head. <laughs> Our supreme oracle has spoken. You will follow your destiny. What? In his awakening. Oh. Oh, maybe you shouldn't have worried about the gun. <laughs> Just jump, jump away. But they're like fish people. Surely they. Oh. They'd chase me in the water, right? I see. You cannot escape my awareness. Hey, buddy. Ah! Oh no. I follow your wanderings, your choices. Oh my fucking god. But it is unavoidable. And as I predicted, you have come to free me. Ooh. Huh? Awaken and call him. Um. Chapter 14, The Coastal Cave. Pierce finally met the Leviathan in flesh and blood. The monstrous creature submitted him to a series of ordeals, at the end of which he decided that the detective was ready to face his destiny. Pierce blew up the whaling station, and after a final confrontation with the Leviathan, he passed out. What? 
What have we done? What have you done? Um, we're trying to free the Leviathan, right? That's only a good thing, right? Because he was chill before. I mean, maybe. I mean, they've been doing horrible things to him. Yeah. Like chopping little bits off him and eating it for lunch. Gun. Oh. There's like a boy. Hello? Fish boy. Fish boy? Oh, fish boy's gone. Okay. Are you sure you're not just seeing things? You've been through a lot. And I have been seeing quite a lot of things recently. Uh, so, I don't know if my vision is the thing to trust right now. But you've got nothing else to go on, really, so... Me? Hello? Keep going. Keep going. Oh my god. Well. This way. <laughs> just in case we thought like, oh, I guess I just jumped down the hole. They're like, no, no, no. fuck. No. No. The side path. Oh my god. But I like that you were willing to do that. <laughs> yeah. But, God. That'd ruin everything. Oh. Is somebody there? Hey. Who are you? Hey, friend. Hey, friend. Are you a fish cultist as well? I think I'm one of you. Uh, where am I? Uh, Coastal Cave, it said at the start. I mean, it felt like some of these cultists weren't really... Were they serving the god, or were they just, just, you know... Eating his yeah. shit. Yeah. Leeching off of it. Trap. Leviathan wanted to be found. Oh. Oh. Okay. The miraculous catch was a trap. Leviathan wanted to be found. Okay. Oh, sweet. To our fallen crew members. They have given their lives for a the last name added is that of Charles Hawkins. I'm willing to bet that they killed all the survivors of the Miraculous Catch. So they could keep the Leviathan secret in the old whaling building? It always comes back to the Scylla. It was where it all began. Laura, Laura. <laughs> oh, I like how you walk straight into the fucking circle. Yeah. Without any thought. Circles are generally fine. God. Uh oh. Oh, oh this, this doesn't seem fine. Huh. Hmm. Uh. I think it's okay. It will soon be time. <gasps> no! You are dead. None of this is real. I saw you dead, as I see you now. Am I crazy too? You survived. Don't you understand? You couldn't die. You will stay alive until you fulfilled your destiny. Oh. No. And then and then what? Look at me. Look at me, Pierce. Dare tell me that you still don't believe it. Boop. Oh. When I was eight, my little brother fell from the apple tree. He was bleeding. I took care of him. 
That very day, I decided to become a doctor. If a bird fell out the tree, would she have been a vet? Yeah. That's what led me to dark water. If it was just an apple, would she have been a horticulturalist? I died That's the rule. To save one of them. Help me give them a second chance. Embrace if it was a dildo, she, would she have worked for Ann Summers? You're out of your mind. <laughs> Anything it's that fell out of that tree. That is at stake. Many men and women have sacrificed themselves for this moment. Colden. You will not deprive them of their hope of a better life. I saw what Leviathan did to Fuller. We will all die like him. His life was written well before it started. It was not predetermined that he lived to see the call. But you? Yes. It is your destiny. The call? This painting. The investigation. Just fully and embrace it. Sam, like you, I was called here by a higher power. Yes. All your choices had the sole purpose of preparing you for the final decision. I must make a choice. Not just make a choice. The right choice. Oh, God. Not yet, but soon. We have one more thing to accomplish. What? It's a really long stealth segment. I must take you to Sarah Hall. Oh, grab oh. chief. Nice. Sarah, I feel her calling me. Let us not wait any longer. Not yet. You have one last thing. This to Sudoku puzzle <laughs> that I've been struggling Please. with. I can't do it. Do you understand what it is? She has already fulfilled her mission. Worry about your own. No. No. No one can fight their faith. Oh no. Neither them nor you. You look like you've been through a lot. It's been a rough couple of days, not gonna lie. Shut up! Silence! Stop! Go away! Stop! I'm proud of you. You didn't make a joke about Lewis there. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Was is that pride or disappointment? Don't resist, Edward. They're already dead. There's nothing you can do. Just <clears throat> give in. Doesn't look good, does it? You going down there? Like it, it could have been a nice picture of you, you know, in a rocking chair with a dog sleeping at your feet. Oh, with some little slippers. Your wife's there. She's got like a. She's cooked a shepherd's pie for you or something. Oh, shepherd's pie, delish. Steaming hot, fresh from the oven. Am I going the right way? That wasn't really like a strong indication on where I should go. I think there's only one way you really can go. Uh, it probably. Oh. Oh. No. <laughs> oh. Maybe it's this way. Hmm. Did we wait? We woke up on oh. the. F we woke up on the shore before. Yeah, but we blacked out a whole bunch oh. and we saw things. But that it feels like we've real. endlessly been going down. Uh, so I've got to go to Alabaster Point. Where Sarah Hawkins is supposed to be waiting for me. There, I must make my final decision that could change the destiny of the world. And we just know this uh, because, oh God. What? 
That rock looks a bit like someone, like, sat down. I don't know, I'm just seeing this things. This pareidolia. Like, can you see, like... No, I can't. Okay, right, imagine no. they sat down towards I, us. I, I passed the sand check, you didn't. <laughs> It's and it's like, like this is their head. It looks like the head of your mother, and it's screaming <laughs> in pain or pleasure. It's like a, it's like a person, man. Anyone else that saw that? They're like clutching their heads, screaming. Oh, that reality as you know it stops here. Oh, okay. What's going on with this fucking? Go. She is waiting. Oh, are those? Oh. Yeah, don't worry about that. Okay, this is quite like a nice little place. These stairs look very dangerous. What have they done to me? Oh. Oh. See, I said, really cool. dangerous. Just a trip hazard. I was expecting you. Fuller. You died in front of my eyes. Don't jump to conclusions. Is there not the tiniest spark of a scientific <coughs> mind inside of that detective skull of yours? What abject substance did you use to turn her into an empty shell? Abject substance? The serum extracted from Leviathan's oil bestows the power of life. To me, my body is nothing but the mortal vessel of my conscience. To you, it contains more answers and secrets than your insignificant mind can grasp. Wait, the oil or his body? The fucking, what a jerk. What, what an arrogant jerk. Who does he think he is? I say we shoot him again. Ugh. Hmm. See, that's what you get when you hire a cowboy builder. Oh. That is not you. Not anymore. Not since your disappearance on the docks. Ah, uh, detective. Uh. So easy to fool you. So eager to rush to the rescue of a woman in distress. Oh. You won't make me regret having tried to save people. I did what I could. Even for Colden. Your efforts to change your destiny Although in vain make you worthy of the fate that is yours, the day has come. You will be asked to choose. To choose. What is it going to be? Um, destroy the world or don't destroy oh my God. the world. It's like the most important question that anyone can ask you. Biscuit or cake? Daddy or chips? Daddy or chips? <laughs> Um, I think it's going to be like, do we sacrifice ourselves or do we sacrifice someone else? Maybe. Is like my. But how many are these people? Any of these people real? Everything nope. For me. Wife, life, destiny. <laughs> you first took your right to a normal life. The moment you chose power over humanity. No one wants to see such an unbearable sight. Oh. Uh. Oh. Oh. Lightest idea of what you speak, of what I've been through. I have sacrificed my life to the one who sleeps. Was this tentacle arm on the other side? My family, my own no. flesh. Why didn't Sarah choose me? Why is it your damn face on her painting? Oh, shit, he got cut. She's jealous. Oh my god. Tom, Jesus. Do I have fish face? Hey, buddy. It's me. But you already know it. I can see that you will make the right choice. Oh. I don't know. I don't know. Your fear of the unknown and your stupid pride cloud your judgment. Quit lying to yourself and embrace your destiny. It's not cowering brought you those medals. None of this is real. Oh. Trust your guts. If nothing's real, what are you? I'm a projection of your mind. 
what remains of that instinct that pulled you out of the trenches. Don't listen to them. They're too dangerous for your tired mind. What are you gonna pick? You're gonna pick truth or reality. <laughs> is that is that gonna be it? Truth or reality? The, the music has gone up a notch. Uh Oh shit, still there. Okay, this is kinda cool. It's kind of like Oh Oh Okay, there's like a big fucking whirlpool. I'm almost there. There's stormy stuff. There's tentacles in the mist. Are these like stairs? No. No. Um, hey oh. guys! Man, I hope you didn't start without me. The cultists must be having a fucking field day right now. Oh look, some of them even get to stand on like hover hover stones. Hover stones. It's a hot new thing. They must be Oh, the kids this. have one. Oh my god. The Scylla, you've got to make a decision. This is blind date. <gasps> da -da, da -da, da -da, what do you pick? Number da -da, one. Da -da. It's truth. <laughs> or number two. Reality. Is or bachelor number three, the tentacle beast from below, the Leviathan. Here you are at last, oh. truth. Oh shit, it's our boy, the librarian. Oh. You were waiting for me. Yes. When I finally discovered the truth, I knew you would come. All this time I was fighting it, afraid of what I might discover. But I was afraid of myself. It's coming. What did you learn? <laughs> Listen to me, Edward Pierce, as I will deliver the truth. I have seen things strange and horrifying, but always true. Will you trust my words? Yes. Mm -hmm. One man, one man only, prepared by the trials and revelations, holds the power to change the world. Because I saw you in the dreams I share with my God. I recognize you for what you are, a truth seeker. One of the rare humans who is able to perceive fragments of his mind. Okay. Yes, yes. I feel the truth in your words. Because it was written, or, as I like to see it, painted on the canvas of fate. Uh -huh. Pierce, help me! Oh. Oh God. Oh God. Sweet. So dagger. So are they wearing masks or are those their faces? I think they're masks. Okay. I think. It's hard <laughs> it's hard to be certain. Perform the counter ritual, I will perform the ritual. <laughs> what are you gonna do? <clears throat> Try and save the world or I kind of fucking wanna see oh, what God. happens. Let's fucking alright, fuck it.
Wait, where's the librarian? Plus, don't stab me. Shit. No. Oh. Okay. You awakened. We sleeper called Cthulhu. Yeah. Apparently, that's what the game was all about: calling Cthulhu. Wow, this whole time. Um. Oh, is there like an epilogue? they'd be happy well this is it like everyone always goes mad when they see like this stuff it's one of the things that like doesn't work about like elder gods in like media is he just looks like a giant giant guy but they're meant to be so like oh. incomprehensible that's not nice ah. Dude, oh. just eating his hand. Bam. <laughs> Fuck. Oh shit, donkey punched. Call of Cthulhu. And that was the good ending, right? I think that's the good ending. Yeah. Us 
beating Sarah Hawkins to death with a rock. Yeah. And I guess Cthulhu reigning supreme. I guess we could see the other ending. Yeah, sure. Do you want to see that? Because it'll be a bit like we saw both endings. Yeah. Uh, that we made the right choice, one way or the other. I'm not sure there is a right choice. I don't know. I feel like if we shoot everyone there, I guess like we probably with your plot gun with endless plot bullets. Only when the plot allows. Pow 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 pow. Plot plot plot. Um, but yeah. <laughs> Uh, so Cthulhu, just big octopus dragon man. <laughs> it's kind of, I don't know. I saw I a saw flash him, of him, and I didn't bite my fingers off. No, but then we didn't actually see him, did we? We saw a depiction of him on a computer monitor. Bam! Perform the counter ritual. Hooray! Oh! Oh Jesus! Fucking Fitzroy! It is the fucking eye. Elder sign! Oh yeah, the elder sign! Hooray! Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh. Where's everyone gone? Oh shit, the rocks are still like hovering, so there's still. Oh. Uh oh. Hmm. Oh shit. We doubled the dosage as you asked us to, Doctor. What? Good. Thank you. Doctor Filler. Oh. Sleeping pills. We did it. Yay. That that so that was a good ending. Well I guess Maybe. Only we went now. mad. Yeah. Rather than everyone going mad. Yeah. Which to be honest is <laughs> if it's, you know, going by the role playing game. Usually, you just go fucking insane, and uh, yeah. But you, you know, you get XP. Yeah, we got tons of experience. Yeah, we saved the world. The world didn't know that we saved it. Yeah, no one's gonna thank us. No. Um, and no, no medals. Doctor Fuller is alive. Maybe. No medals for us. We're like Chewbacca at the end of Star Wars: New Hope. Oh shit! There's no medals. Mm. Just stood there. It's a, it's, I think it's a race thing. Because you can't talk. Talk properly. Uh, so, Ben, what um, do you think of Call of Cthulhu? Me? Yeah. I thought you were asking the viewer. What did you think of Call of Cthulhu as well? Let us know. Down there. Nice. But what did you like it? Did you enjoy it? Yeah, it was a, it was a, it was a journey. It was nice. It's a, it's a good entry into into the um, Cthulhu mythos. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a good. solid entry. I mean, I don't know how much we could have changed. You know. I, th I feel like the story is pretty linear. Like, we may not have been able to change that much. Because there are a lot of things that said, you know, has changed your destiny, but I'm not sure how. How different it could have been. How different are other people's playthroughs of this? I thought it was pretty good. There were some ropey game mechanics, and the game, all in all, looked a little bit dated. Mm. But, had good atmosphere. I liked the the spooky spookiness. It wasn't too spooky, but it was more like, you know, 
mad madness and insanity. Um, but there's, lots, there's a lot of dread. Like we knew that bad shit was going to happen. Yeah, and that that was cool. <laughs> um, yeah, I thought it was, I thought it was a really solid game. I thought it was good fun. Maybe check it out. Although I guess like you've already kind of seen seen a lot of the game has to offer now. Oh. <laughs> but maybe play it yourself. Um, if they brought out another one, I would I'd play it. Yeah, yeah. If my they God. did like one with, if they did Call of Cthulhu at the Mountains of Madness or something, I'd, oh I'd play God. that. Or, oh my God! Oh uh, my God! Giant penguins. Or if they did like a proper Shadow over <laughs> Innsmouth type one. Can you imagine that? You're just in an icy landscape and you're like, oh. Oh God, where am I? And then there's like a giant penguin, and suddenly it goes do 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 because you're going mad. Oh seeing shit! It. <laughs> ah! Fuck that penguin's so big. <laughs> well, and then the... you're scared of birds from that moment on. Oh Anytime man! Anytime you see a bird, that, or something that, fluffy. That'd be the w- all fluffy. Yeah, penguins are fluffy. Little ones are. Yeah. Baby. Oh ones. my God! So it's a baby giant penguin. It's a giant penguin. And baby already that's penguin. like twenty feet tall. Yeah. <laughs> Me. Uh, pal, well, <laughs> uh, until next time, everybody. Oh. Ah, oh. Your destiny has changed. Oh, God. Oh, hello, it's me, Cthulhu. What a great series this has been. I shall sure hope that you check out some of the other great series on this channel. It's my favourite. Maybe let us know below if you've got any ideas for other games that these guys should play. What fun!